what makes me unique are the people I surround myself with, the things I do, and the things I think about. I'm aiming. <laughs> there you go. I got it! <laughs> I love doing fun, crazy things with my parents, siblings, nieces or nephews, friends, old men with whom I worked on a research farm. It doesn't really matter how long I've known someone or what we're doing because regardless, we're having a good time. Adding to my uniqueness is my uncanny ability to act without regard to social normality. I don't let my fears of what others may think challenge what I'm doing or what I should do. This has helped me do atypical things to help others find solutions to unique problems and make strides to improve how I interact with other people. If it wasn't for my carefree approach to social situations, I wouldn't have made the friends in high school that I did. Beyond getting me through high school, they've inspired me to excel in college, hike to the top of mountains, and further challenge the limitations I place for myself. Those friends were also influential in helping me turn outward and truly see those around me and want to help those I meet. It may not be a genuinely unique thing to prioritize relationships and serve other people, but I've come to realize that there exists a difference in the way my mind works in contrast to others' minds. Generally, what makes me most unique is that I like to challenge my fears. I do things because I used to think that I couldn't do it. I do things because, at one point in time, someone doubted my ability to do it. I do hard, scary, even intimidating things in order to overcome trivial apprehensions. I've gone ziplining for, obviously, the experience, but also because I used to be deathly afraid of heights. I'd be so Ooh, I think it's gonna be a Kenzie. I strike up conversations with strangers because I feel that, despite my feelings of social anxiety, I could help in some way with something they're going through or could even just brighten their day. Sometimes I eat different kinds of intimidating food, not just to say that I did, <laughs> but also because it opens up doors to different cultures and ways of thinking. If I always eat the same thing, how could I know what I truly like and don't like? How could I empathize with others? If I hadn't eaten menudo or tried all the spicy salsas, would I know Spanish as well as I do? I believe that I can conquer my fears. I believe that I can improve myself. I believe that I can make a difference in this world. I believe that everything will work out in the end. Maybe what truly makes me unique is my faith in myself, the goodness of others, and God. <laughs>